Now I have already done a video on twining, so if you do want to check that out, then I will put a card with my head. This is a new range. I say new, it's a newish range. So the flavors that I have got is pomegranate, elderflower, and lemon balm. And then I also have lemon, lime, and green mate. And then mandarin and rosemary. What they're saying is, is that you've obviously got that flavor from whatever they're saying, but on top of that, you're getting an added benefit of say like vitamin C, this one's vitamin C as well, or this one is magnesium. Now, I'm just gonna be honest here, like if you have a low amount of vitamin C or magnesium in your diet, I wouldn't recommend having these to get that up because in my opinion, I feel like it's better to just eat fruit and veg, which are naturally high in vitamin C or magnesium, that's probably nuts. That will be a better way for your body to ingest their nutrients rather than in this because I don't really know the format or the amount. Okay, so it's got 20% magnesium in here. This is using vitamin C granules, which is a 4.5%. And then you've also got in here vitamin C granules at 4.5%, but in them vitamin C granules, how well is that going to be absorbed into your body? Do you know what I mean? So yeah, that's just my opinion. I wouldn't be having this just to get my vitamin C up. I would just go and have some oranges, um, anything that's high in vitamin C, fruit or veg, I would just go and eat that. Let's just get into it. Okay, don't, don't fall off your seat when I tell you how much I paid for this. I paid £4.50 each. So I've got three. Quick maths. Ultimately, that's a negative in my eyes because this is four, four pound fifty. That's a lot of money, right? So essentially, all you all you do is you get the one little bag, one little infuser, and you drop it into your bottle. You add five hundred milliliters of cold water, give it a shake, leave it for five minutes, and then you drink it. And that is it. Uh, and that's all the same for all the other ones. They're suitable for vegetarians, suitable for vegans. Let's read the blurb. So enjoy at least one serving per day as part of a varied and balanced diet and healthy lifestyle. Warning, this product contains a mineral and has been developed for adults, not suitable for children aged 12 and under. Store in a cool, dry place or away from strong odours. Keep in original packaging once jars open, reseal, lid and consume in six months. So Twinings do actually have an infuser for kids. So if you do want to check that out, I will leave it on my face somewhere you can have a look. I'm going to try the pomegranate and elderflower lemon balm first. Oh! <laughs> Drop, leave, enjoy, shake. When I was at uni, it's really bad. I think I might already mention this, but I used to love um, ribe strawberry ribena. Obviously, I love strawberry. And what I used to do... Oh, I can smell that. Woo! Wee! Pomegranate! <laughs> um, what I used to do is I used to get the ribena syrup and then I used to drink it out of the, the plastic bottle and then I'd used to like drink some water. So you know how you're supposed to like dilute it? I wouldn't do that. I would just drink it straight, like a little sip, and then drink some water. Get, like, you know what I, mean? I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> you know, that was just a strong smell. <sighs> no first snow messages drop and go. Just like a little netting. There's the white stuff in there. All right, let's get some water. Yeah, it smells of like pomegranate. Okay, so I've got my water, um, my shaker. I'm gonna get one of these pomegranate ones, pop it in, <laughs> and then just do that. It has changed colour. So. Keep your bottle squeaky clean by washing after each use, yeah. So it's best drunk within one hour, but it's good for up to eight, as long as it's kept out of direct sunlight. Oh, there's no sugar in here. Nine calories, 0.07 grams of salt. Then you've got 15% of your recommended intake of uh, magnesium in this one. One gram of fat. Fat? Really? That's got one gram of fat in it? Where's the fat coming from? Oh, you know what it is, right? In the other one that I reviewed, the flavour is there, you get a flavour, but it tastes artificial, like it's not that natural, beautiful, like fruity, pomegranate, lemon, elderflower, it, uh, it tastes manufactured, it tastes artificial. 
But they're saying they're using natural pomegranate flavourings with other flavourings. Natural elderflower flavourings with other flavourings. These herbal ingredients are specially heat treated to make them safe to drop into cold water. Um, it's actually really hard to describe. Like, I can't taste that much lemon. It's like a really slight elderflower and pomegranate. The smell, it smells a lot better than it tastes. That's what I think. I'm not really a fan of that one. If you did see my last video, I really, really enjoyed the strawberry one because obviously I love the strawberry. Mm -mm. I'm not really a fan of this one. Tastes a bit like metally as well. Like, you know what I mean? It's probably the magnesium in there. They do actually have their own shakers. Um, but obviously, they're going to be really, really expensive and you're better off just getting your own shaker for half the price of Amazon. Right, I'm going to go on to my next one, okay? This one is okay. It's not really that much of a flavour. This is natural flavourings, but to me, I, it just tastes artificial. So I wouldn't buy that one again. Thumbs down for me. The second one that I'm going to try is mandarin and rosemary. This actually sounds really nice. I love mandarin. I love rosemary. Now this is saying it's, it's got that extra vitamin C in, so let's open this bad boy up. I like how it's got that little tab. Right, smell test. Sensors at the ready. Here we go. Whoa, rosemary. Rosemary. If you don't like rosemary, do not get this. Wow, it's so cool. I love the netting. It just it looks like it's just full of rosemary, like legit. I mean, on the plus side, if you're low on rosemary for your pasta, just cut into this and just take all this rosemary out. Oh, so strong. Can you see that there? I think this is going to be overpowering rosemary, but I'm going to plop it in. Three, two, one, plop. Give it a shake and I'm going to go near the sink again and give it a shake and I'll see you back in five minutes. That's actually really, really odd. So on all of the other Twinings bags infused that I've done, it's always changed colour, but this hasn't changed colour. You're not changing. Wow. That's so cool to watch. So mesmerising. Hypnotising me. I wonder why that hasn't changed colour. Right, let's crack, let's crack this open. I feel like it's now turned to like a murky... No, it's still white my eyes are deceiving me. Maybe it's like a really, really tinty light. A light yellow, but no. Oh, I can smell the mandarin. As soon as you open the tub and smell the actual bag, you don't smell mandarin at all. <laughs> Oh, what? That is so weird. Mm. Oh, I don't know how I feel about that. So you can taste the mandarin. It leaves that mandarin-like flavour in your mouth, but you don't taste that much thyme. It's like an aftertaste of thyme, but not strong. It's like, but you know it's there. Mm. Oh, that's... That works really well. They're saying that vitamin C contributes to the reduction of tiredness and fatigue. 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 <laughs> fatigue! Oh my god. Fatigue. Mm. Okay. This one is still definitely last. This one, I'm going to say is... I'm going to put this one in the middle because I feel like... You get that mandarin flavour and the thyme isn't overpowering at all. It's so subtle, but it's like refreshing at the same time. I think what would be really cool, like in the summer, uh, putting the, putting one of these in, but making like an ice cold drink to so put like ice in there, maybe some like mint, um, like spruce it up a little bit and it would be a really nice, cool drink to have in the summer. I'm still getting your water intake in as well. Yeah, I'm down for that. I like that idea. Yeah, so the rosemary doesn't come out as much. It's the more the mandarin, but the smell is more rosemary. I think it was just the over, that overpowering rosemary smell. And even in the tea bag, it looks like, yeah, it just smells of rosemary. 
smells good though. Right, we'll move on to the last one now, which is lemon, lime, and green mate. I don't know what mate is, let me have a look. Hmm, see, this is why I love maroon stuff, because I always learn. So mate is a traditional South American caffeine-rich infused drink. It is made by soaking dried leaves of the holy, not holy, holy species, I can't pronounce the name, Ilex paragonesis, in hot water and is served with a metal straw in a container typically made from a calabash gourd. Wow, shiver me timbers. <laughs> That's really cool. Green mate, which is in at 43%, natural lemon flavouring, white hibiscus, stevia leaves, natural lime flavouring with other natural flavourings, vitamin C granules. Vitamin C contributes to normal collagen formation for the normal function of skin. Here's a fresh idea for cold water, just own one infuser, no kettle or caboodle required. What's a caboodle? What's a caboodle? I don't, I just don't know what caboodle means. I put in caboodle kitchen, maybe it's like related to the kitchen. And there is an actual company called Caboodle Kitchens. And now I'm just looking at kitchens. This one is nine calories per 500 millilitres. So for life's glow getters, I like that. I'm a glow getter. Yes, queen. <laughs> They're biodegradable infusers. Um, did you know that stevia is a natural plant renowned for its intensely sweet taste? Originally native to Central and South America, the stevia plant has been used for hundreds of years to sweeten foods and drinks. I went to a food show a couple of years ago and I heard about stevia, and this is when uh, it all kicked off with like sugar reduction and sugar alternatives and things like that. If you go into supermarkets now and you will see so many sugar replacements and stevia is one of them and one of them is there. If you want me to look into like sugar replacements or sweeteners, then let me know in the comment section below because that'll be quite interesting to talk around what the hyper sweeteners are out there or sugar alternatives or how to make your food sweeter without using sugar. Yeah, let me know. So I'm gonna open this one now. I don't know why I get excited every time I see that. You know, it's really cool just to open it again. You know, it's that, that fresh feeling, you know? Fresh, fresh, fresh. Oh, okay, ready. Sensors up there, ready. Mm. Now, I've never tried mate before. I'm really hoping I'm pronouncing that correctly. Mate. So I don't know if that is what it should smell like. Oh, you know what the white stuff is? I just realized. That must be the vitamin C granules. That, it has to be. I'm a CIA agent. That's my theory. It smells like when you open your like your herb cupboard, like a dull down herb cupboard. All right, let's pop one in. <laughs> All right, gonna come back in five minutes, give it a shake, give it a whirl. This one has actually changed color. See that? It's like a musky green. So the smell, it smells lemony and it smells limey. Oh, if anyone has tried mate, by the way, can you let me know what it tastes like? Cause that'd be kind of cool and if there's any like shops that sell it that i can like buy some and try some just in my spare time you know right i'm going into the kill smell lemon lemon and lime to me it's just lemon and lime but then i don't know what this mate tastes like so i don't really know what i'm looking for mm. This is another one of the ones that I would have in the summer. Squeeze some fresh lime in, add a little bit of sugar, put some ice. You know, when you're in the summer and you're with your family and you know, you're just having a good time. You're just having a good time of life, really. Okay, so I know for certain, this one is last in my preference. Mm. Now it's, it's kind of hard to toss up, but I feel like this one is a little bit sweeter which I like. 
So for that reason, this one is going to be my top one and this one is going to be my second and obviously pomegranate is last. Um, yeah, the other two don't seem that sweet, but I think because it's got that lemon lime flavour and lemon is like sweet in a way, I think. So this one I think is top, but again, the only negative is that they're £4.50, like it's really, really expensive. If they were on offer, I would buy them. I normally just tend to stick to like squash, like Robinsons. I don't buy Ribena strawberry anymore because I know it's really bad for me. And I don't want to buy the sugar-free version because it's just not the same. It's not the same, okay? Like you're trying to be the same, but it's not the same. And I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna fall for it, okay? You don't fool me. Again, like I said earlier, don't rely on products like these. So you know, oh, we've got and vitamin C. Like yeah, it's it's good that it has that, but if you're wanting to make a considerable change in your diet then actually find these sources in fruit and vegetables so that is everything from today's video if you enjoyed it please give it a big thumbs up and be sure to subscribe to me if you're not already if there is any other drinks that you guys want me to have a look at um, then please do let me know in the comment section below but that is everything that i want to talk to you about next week i've got a really really special video going up because min's meals is turning two years old I've been doing YouTube for two years. I feel like it's more like a year because you know me, I just get consistent. I just fall off the face of the earth. <laughs> and then I'm like, hi, I'm back again. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, I started it in 2019, February 2019. So I made a little special video for you. If you do want to check out my one year anniversary video, I'll leave a card link up. I'll hopefully see you all in my next video. Bye. I'll be back.